All right, so here we have Printful.com. Now I know a lot about Printful because in Charlotte, North Carolina, when I lived there at one point in my life, I uh, used to work for this company. So I kinda got an idea on what Printful is. Now, the website that I was, well actually my bad, the YouTube channel that I was watching, Earn Your Leisure, there's a guy on there that was teaching on how to make your own clothing brand. Now your clothing brand is gonna be automated through Printful.com. Now it is important that you watch the Earn Your Leisure podcast in order to know how to do this step by step because he will break it down. Now what you do is you're gonna create your clothing brand on Printful.com. You're gonna create a Shopify, upload your company to Shopify, and then it's an automated system. You just gotta start getting the markets. You start gotta start getting the people, the crowd flow to go towards your uh, to go towards your website. And what happens is you can be out doing what you do, cutting grass, throwing the football, going on your dates, hanging out with your friends sleeping and because it's an automated system printful is a warehouse printful warehouses are all over the world so what they will do is they will make your product slap your label onto that product and after they're done slapping your label onto that product you can upload your product and stuff to your shopify so when people go check out your shopify however you're going to advertise your shopify through business cards, flyers, whatever. When they get on there and they see that, when they get on there and they see that uh, you have clothes, socks, t-shirts, underwear, whatever it is for sale, they purchase it. Now because Printful is the ones making this product and they're doing all the dirty work, they're gonna take a percentage of it. But for an automated system, let's say you charge $100, they take their $50, $60, and you get $40. You just got $40 for doing nothing but just advertising that you got a clothing brand. So let's go in here and take a look. So first, you will have to download. It's a Printful app, but I prefer you get a computer. Computers are like $200. Get you a computer, come into Printful, sign up and everything, register that you're going to do a business. And the first step, you will sign up for Printful. Second step, you're gonna confirm. Third step, you're gonna create a product. Product. Then right there on that fourth one, connect your store. I haven't got to that yet. I have a Shopify, but I haven't connected it yet. Then you do all the other stuff and samples and everything. Now, it's so much stuff. Be sure to read through everything. Read through all of this stuff, man. You're not doing nothing. Make sure you read through everything on this computer. I'm talking about all the way down to services, policies, everything. Read through the stuff. Reading through things is how you protect yourself. This is how you don't mess something up. All right? So, here we go. And now over here on this side, you got products, templates, stores, billing, warehouses. See? They have warehouses and everything like that. Um... They have a product catalog. All right. So for those of you who just missed that, let me go back. See my arrow up here, back. Okay. Now. Once you get stuff situated, it should be on a screen like this. Welcome, Kevin Loving. That's my name. It should say welcome blank, whatever your name is. Welcome. You're going to go down, 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 down. All right. They have different uh, bars. They got a bar for here. And they got a bar for over there. So you have to make sure that you scroll down. Okay. Product catalog. Alright. Product catalog. See, you can slap labels on mugs. You can slap labels on phone cases. They have a lot of stuff on here. And make sure you test your product out. Meaning, buy your own product and see how the clothes fit you. How they feel to you. 
before you go out here trying to sell your product to someone else. All right. Now, here we got hats, beanies, uh, baseball caps, bucket hats, all type of things. Now, it is important to know your market. And when I say know your market, that means you should know who you're selling to. Please do not say everyone because there is no such thing. Everyone don't eat McDonald's. Everyone don't eat Burger King. Everyone don't eat Wendy's. Everyone don't shop at H&M. Everyone don't shop at Google. Everyone don't have an iPhone. Everyone don't got a Samsung. You feel what I'm saying? Everyone don't got a Mustang. So do not say your target market is everybody. Focus on a specific target market. Where I'm at, we have a lot of truckers. We have a lot of country boys. We got a lot of cowboys and things like that. They like wearing the flannels with the jeans and the boots and the trucker hats. So this is how you flow the money within your businesses. I have a mobile detailing service, but on my card, I'm going to have a website where they can check out like clothes and stuff. Now the clothes and stuff that I wear and advertise is going to be for them to come check it out on their website. That is to get them to come in to look at my website. Now I'm going to have other things on that website, but I will advertise those other things towards those specific markets. But let's go ahead and uh, show you what I'm talking about here. So you select what type of hat you want or whatever the case may be. And it's the same thing. It's like if you're looking on Finish Line, Foot Locker, Hibbit Sports, Champs, you find what it is you're looking for over here, okay? Men's clothing, all right? T-shirts, embroideries, all type of things, long sleeves. They got jackets, hoodies. They got bottoms, leggings, underwear. Everything is on here, okay? So what you're going to do is I'm going to select T-shirt. All right. Now, they got different types of T-shirt brands. That's why I say you have to pick which one and get it sent to you so you can see how the material feels. All right. See how the material feels. on, And they got different colors and everything. See that? Different colors. And it's just light. Just like you going on Foot Locker or Finish Line or something. But you're putting your own labels on your stuff and uploading it to your website, to your Shopify. All right. So I'm going to, let's select this one here. All right, a tie-dye shirt. Hmm, what color would I like? You can go through the colors. Let's go with the red and yellow, okay? Classic rainbow. Now, on this tie-dye shirt, it lets you know the price, how long it take to ship, and then you can select how many you want, all that at the end. I'm going to start designing. All right. Here we are. Create your order. And you literally just get to play around. You get to play around with the stuff. See? Choose file, classic text, clip art, all type of things, okay? So what I'm going to do is choose a file, all right? Now, the reason I removed my phone from you looking at this is because I have other things saved in my files. And they got videos and stuff on embroidery design, all you need to know. It's important that you watch these videos. Now, I'm not watching this video right now because I already seen it, but it's just so you watch that video, except I have reviewed the requirements. Don't show this again. Uh, no, I like to watch stuff plenty of times. So here I am in my file library. Now, how did I get this? There are people on Instagram, on websites, different things that are called graphic designers. They do artwork. Sometimes you'll see them post videos at the bottom of their pages, at the bottom of your Instagram page or the famous celebrities. I do artwork. I do this in the comment section. Just talk to one of them. Tell them what type of artwork you need. Uh, they'll create the artwork for you. Make sure it's a legit person. Because people be out here stealing. Make sure it's a legit person. You get them to make some artwork or a graphic design for you. Have them send it over to your email. Once they send it over to your email, save it to your computer. 
when you save it to your computer, it will pop up in your little folder, okay? If you don't have a computer to save it on yet, it's important to get a flash drive. On my flash drive, I have a lot of things saved that isn't on this computer. You can always, you know what I'm saying, move around with this. So, what happens is you got your artwork and things like that done. Um, okay, hold on. There is a artwork. No, that is not it. It's not what I want. Alright, hold on. There are some things that are not in my folder. And so far you just seen two graphic artworks. I have more than two. I have three actually. So let's see what the issue is here. Yep, you can see, I see I have other letters and things like that. I also work on my credit, like I stated in my videos before. This is the artwork that I wanted to show y'all what I'm talking about. second hand away. We're going to get this together. Alright. Alright. I'm going to create me a folder. Alright. And the new folder is going to be named See, I don't want this inside of my credit folder. Yep, there we go, trash. That's it. That's one of my artworks, everybody. I'm going to just go with the other artworks I have already. So we're going to choose file. Remember? All right, we'll start over since I got, I don't want y'all to be confused or nothing like that. All right, yes, leave the page. All right, here we go. So remember, we selected our shirt, came down. Started designing, create your order. Just really play around with the website. You can always start over. Don't be afraid to mess up. Don't let fear get in the way of your goals and your dreams. All right. Don't check this box. I have reviewed the requirements. Don't show this again. Meaning they won't show this video for you again. 
every time you get ready to create, just watch this video if you forget something. But if you check this box, it won't pop up. Then you have to go somewhere else inside this website to find it. So I accept, add a little clip art. Um, we're gonna go with this one place. All right. Now look at that. Here we have Hold on, it ain't, it ain't working. Bar center. Fine. Oh, there we go. Drop your design here. All right, so I found it. I, I found how to do it. All right, so we're gonna, we're gonna get up out of that. I'm gonna choose a different color shirt. So uh, it'll make more sense to me and to y'all, you know. So based on the different, I mean, y'all can play around with this stuff, really, man. Really just play around with this stuff. All right, here we go. Basic black shirt. All right. Choosing my color. Start my design. Remember, I learned all this stuff from Earn Your Leisure Podcast. I learned this from Earn Your Leisure Podcast. And they had a guy in there talking about automating your merch. Type in Earn Your Leisure Merch. Okay. Actually, I'll show you the video up here. Yo, man, it's this is really like really crazy. Earn your leisure. Printful. Scroll down, and this is how I learn from these guys right here. These these guys, how to make a fortune selling merch. You can learn how to sell clothes. Let's take a look at their channel. All right. Earn your leisure videos. A two hour podcast, safest stocks to invest in. Is Dave Ramsey right? Why Microsoft and Apple stocks?